Hey, welcome to Drop Academy. My name is Mike. In this lesson, we're gonna install Hugo on a Macintosh. So the first thing we wanna do is head over to your browser and up here in the browser window, we're gonna type in Homebrew. Now, Homebrew is a program that you can get on Mac and it's what we call a package manager, okay? So a package manager is a program that lets you uh, install, download, and maintain other programs, okay? That's basically all it does. Uh, Homebrew is a really popular version of that, and um, we can use Homebrew to install Hugo on our computer. So you want to make sure that this guy pops up right here. It's uh, just brew.sh, and once you see that, just click on it. It's going to bring you to a page that looks like this. It's a pretty simple page, uh, and really all we need from here is just this one line of code, okay? So we see this guy. It's, it's just like basically a piece of code that we're going to paste into our terminal. So you want to copy this and you're gonna head over to your search bar and just type in terminal and your OSX terminal should pop up. We're just gonna paste that command and um, a bunch of stuff should pop up here. You wanna click enter and then you're gonna have to enter your password. Once you do that, uh, Homebrew should start downloading and installing. There should be just a bunch of code that comes up here. Now, depending on your computer and your internet speed, this could take, you know, uh, a couple minutes, but for the most part, it, it shouldn't take too long. Um, and then once you get, you know, an installation successful message, then you're good to go. So once you have um, Brew on your computer, we can use Brew to install Hugo. And the command for that is um, going to be Brew install Hugo. Okay, so you want to type these three guys in here and we're just gonna click enter and you'll notice that homebrew is gonna start doing a bunch of stuff um, generally when you're installing something using homebrew the first thing it'll do is like update itself uh, since we just downloaded that since we just downloaded it, it's probably not gonna do that um, but basically it should just download and you'll get some messages here so as long as you don't get a error message then um, you're good to go and once you've done that, the way that we can validate our install is just by um, typing in which Hugo. And if this doesn't throw an error and it gives you a location, then um, it, it should be good to go. This is the location of our Hugo file, so it's in user local bin Hugo. Another thing we want to do is test out the Hugo command. So we can type out Hugo version. And this should spit out a version number. So in my case, it's 0 0.26. As long as Hugo version doesn't throw any errors or you don't get anything uh, wrong with it, then uh, Hugo is officially installed on your Mac. So you're, you're ready to go. Hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe to Draft Academy to be the first to know when we release new content. Also, we're always looking to improve, so if you have any constructive criticism or questions or anything, leave a comment below. Finally, if you're enjoying Draft Academy and you want to help us grow, head over to draftacademy.com forward slash contribute and invest in our future.